I want to talk to you about refining your bow draw today. What I see in most of my clients, or a lot of my clients, is using the bow draw to initiate a turn instead of using a bow draw to complete a turn and or to make a turn uh, more effective and efficient. And I also see people thinking that this doing this as they're as they're floating down waiting to catch an eddy they think that this is a bow draw right I'm gonna demonstrate right now what a bow draw looks like and I'm gonna I'm gonna spin myself in a circle using a bow draw okay so a bow draw isn't this Right? Um, a bow draw isn't this. <laughs> a bow draw uses a core rotation, so I rotate and then I feather my wrist and my hands are stacked, so it's a very vertical stroke. And depending on how tight I want to make the turn or, or whether I just want to make a small adjustment, so in other words, my end goal determines how far away from my boat I position my paddle. If I just want to make a slight, uh, a slight turn, a slight change of direction, then my bow draw is going to be up closer to the front. If I want to really refine a turn, complete a, a big turn, right? My bow, I might plant my bow draw a little further away. I don't keep my boat flat paddle and then initiate a bow draw to try and turn. My turn is initiated either with edge. Or maybe I, I engage a little bit of edge and do a sweep or a stern draw on the opposite side. And so what that would look like would be sweep into a bow draw, okay? And then I could turn my bow draw into a forward stroke, which is super effective. I'm not paddling along and then just initiating a bow draw trying to turn my boat. I can do that. What ends up happening though is I place my shoulder in a very precarious position and I almost break because if if I plant, if my boat is not edged, it's flat and I plant my bow draw here, you can actually get some separation between the two. And also remember that floating downstream waiting for something to happen, <laughs> this is just dragging your paddle in the water. Anytime you do plant a bow draw, it is active, right? I rotate plant and I close the scissors between my boat and my paddle blade. So those are some refinements for your bow draw. So just to recap, the bow draw is a finishing stroke to make a turn more efficient or to make maneuvering more efficient. It's initiated first with edge right or a stern draw or sweep on the opposite side there's rotation into it it's a nice vertical stroke and it's active